So to me, Sonic Masquerade is bringing together all the greatest hits you never heard and rescuing these songs. I have so many friends who are just incredibly talented musicians who worked all over the world in music and they have incredible recordings that have never been released on the radio. And so our Sonic Masquerade radio is here to give artists like uh, these friends of mine a chance to, to get their stuff in the air and to make sure that uh, their mission here, you know, that they have something they can leave behind and know that it's in the air and that it's not in a box somewhere. Uh, these are mastered hits. They're just so wonderful. So many of these songs. And what I want to do with Sonic Masquerade also is create a venue, uh, a channel, uh, a place in which artists can come and um, we, can, we can get them out there and uh, get a following for them, get them heard, get them seen, and also get them paid. So that's why if anybody uh, does sign a publishing deal with us, we give 90% to the artist, we take 10%. And the 10% we take, we put back into Sonic Masquerade for advertising the artists. So that's the way it works. Um, a few months ago, um, a friend of mine, Burke Wallace, passed away. And I found out on the internet, over the social media, he was a great musician. And he was such a nice guy. And, you know, I, I, I said to a couple of my bandmates, I said, what's going to happen to Burke's music now? like all these other artists, you know, these great players. And if they didn't get like some major deal, you know, or if they had a deal, but they didn't have one at the time when they passed or whatever, you know, then they have some friend that's got their belongings. And they're not a musician. The next thing you know, these tapes end up in a closet, <laughs> you know, and then they end up in a landfill. Um, and uh, if this is like the last thing I do before I die, then this will be, I'll be very proud of myself to say that I archived all these artists and all this fantastic footage and not just singers, songwriters, and bands, but also, you know, sculptors and painters. And, um, I have my friend Nathan Cartwright who has the Hive Gallery with like 66 original artists in his gallery and they're just incredible. And, um, you know, if you're going to buy something for the holidays, um, give the gift of art. Give the gift of these one-of-a-kind one pieces that you can only get at the Hive Gallery. You can go to hivegallery.com and check that out. But, you know, that's what I'm about. I want to connect people to each other. I want to take uh, my crowd and people who are following what we're doing here, and I want to say, hey, here's some fantastic art you'll never see anywhere else and turn you on to it. Here, here's a great song produced over the top. So, uh, you know, I just, I, you know, I worked in the, in, the, in the record industry. I worked for a record label for a while, and I quit because it was so bogus, you know. So, you know, I, I really want Sonic Masquerade to be a place, uh, a safe haven for really talented artists to come and get heard.